$1.5 billion worldwide. Monica Ricks, CBS News. The following is a test of the emergency alert system. Testing its emergency alert system equipment. The EAS will provide timely emergency warnings. This station serves the Pittsburgh Extended Operational Area. This concludes this emergency alert system test. Air One, worship now. This is a test of the emergency alert system. This has been a test of the emergency alert system designed to keep you informed of national, state, and local emergencies. Air One. Worship now. Sponsored by the vet. This is a test of the broadcast stations of your area. Equipment that can quickly warn you during emergencies is being tested. If this had been an actual emergency, official messages would have followed the alert tone. This concludes this test of the emergency alert system. The following program will be recorded. KFI News is following the storm that is impacting parts of Southern California. Here is the latest from the National Weather Service. A special marine warning for the following inner waters from Point Magu to San Mateo Point. California, including Santa Catalina and Santa Barbara Islands. The National Weather Service in Oxnard has issued a special marine warning for inner waters from Point Magu to San Mateo Point. California, including Santa Catalina and Anacapa Islands, until 6.15 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. At 5.46 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time, a line of strong storms and isolated thunderstorms capable of producing water spouts was located 8 nautical miles southwest of Dana Point, moving northeast at 20 knots. Hazard, water spouts, wind gusts to nearly 50 knots, and small hail. Source, radar. Impact, water spouts can create locally hazardous seas. Small craft could be damaged in briefly higher winds and suddenly higher waves. Locations impacted include Dana Point and Newport Harbor. Water spouts can easily overturn boats and create locally hazardous seas. Seek safe harbor immediately. Daylight time Wednesday. National Weather Service in Oxnard has issued a tornado warning for Central Ventura County in southwestern California, southwestern Los Angeles County in southwestern California, until 8.30 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. At 8.17 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located over Point Magu State Park, or 10 miles south of Camarillo, moving northeast at 35 miles an hour. Hazard, Tornado. Source, radar indicated rotation. Impact, expects damage to mobile homes, roofs, and vehicles. This dangerous storm will be near western Malibu around 8.25 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. Newberry Park around 8.30 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. Other locations impacted by this tornadic thunderstorm include Naval Base Ventura County. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Oh. 
Other locations impacted by this tornadic thunderstorm include Naval Base Ventura County. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. the Metroplex. Stand by as we alert our other stations in the area on WBAP. We interrupt programming at the request of the National Weather Service to activate the North Texas Emergency Alert System. The National Weather Service has issued new severe thunderstorm warnings for the following counties, for Somerville and Hood counties, for Erath County, for Parker County, just west of Fort Worth, and for Palo Pinto County, all until 515. A line of severe thunderstorms is located from seven miles west of Palo Pinto down to near Dublin, moving northeast at 50 miles per hour. These strong storms are intensifying. They have 65 mile per hour wind gusts and quarter sized tail. They triggered a tornado watch off to the west of the Dallas Fort Worth area earlier. Now a, torn- a severe thunderstorm watch is being issued for the immediate Dallas Fort Worth area, which we will broadcast shortly. Once again, new severe thunderstorm warnings are being issued now for Hood and Somerville counties, for Erath and Parker counties, and for Palo Pinto County until 5.15, a line of severe thunderstorms extending from west of the city of Palo Pinto down to Dublin, moving northeast at 50 miles per hour. These storms will reach the DFW metropolitan areas within the next hour. All North Texas stations affected by this alert are requested to relay the preceding message. Okay, that's what we have in terms of 5.30. Stand by as we alert our other stations in the area on WBAP. We are our programming at the request of the National Weather Service to activate the North Texas Emergency Alert System. National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Wise, Jack, Parker County, and for Palo Pinto counties until 5.30. Severe thunderstorms uh, nine miles east of Grayford or 10 miles north of Mineral Wells are moving northeast at a speed of 50 miles per hour. These storms may contain some 65-mile-per-hour wind gusts and quarter-sized tail. Once again, severe thunderstorm warnings being issued now for Wise County, for Jack County, Parker, and Palo Pinto counties until 5.30. Severe thunderstorms just east of Grayford, not far from Possum Kingdom Lake, moving to the northeast at 50 miles per hour. All North Texas stations affected by this alert are requested to relay the preceding message. Service has issued a tornado warning for southern Wise County and for northern Parker County. Stand by as we alert our other stations in the area on WBAT. We interrupt programming at the request of the National Weather Service to activate the North Texas Emergency Alert System. The National Weather Service has issued tornado warnings for southwestern Wise County and for northern Parker County until 5.30. A severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado is located near Poolville, about 10 miles northeast of Mineral Wells, moving northeast at 60, 60 miles per hour. This storm may contain a tornado. Flying debris can be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes can be damaged or destroyed. This storm will be near Poolville right at 5 o'clock. 
just within the next couple of minutes. Springtown around 510, Briar and Reno by 515, and Boyd by 520. If this storm continues, it could also be entering southwestern Denton County within the next 15 minutes. Once again, a tornado warning has now been issued for southwestern Wise County and northern Parker County until 530. A severe thunderstorm near Poolville or about 10 miles northeast of Mineral Wells, moving northeast at 60 miles per hour. All stations affected by this alert are requested to rebroadcast the preceding message. New severe thunderstorm warnings are being issued now for portions of Somerville, Johnson, Parker, Tarrant, and Hood counties. Stand by as we alert our other stations in the area on WBAP. We interrupt programming at the request of the National Weather Service to activate the North Texas Emergency Alert System. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for the following counties, Somerville County, Johnson County, Parker County, Tarrant County, and Hood County until 615. Severe thunderstorms are located along a line that extends from Springtown up in northeastern Parker County down to near Granbury, all moving northeast at 55 mile per hour. Uh, 55 mile per hour movement to the northeast and 65 mile per hour wind gusts along with at least penny sized hail, which could become larger. There are spotter reports of 62 mile per hour winds coming in momentarily. There are also reports of multiple mobile homes being overturned in Parker County at this time. Once again, severe thunderstorm warnings now activated for Somerville and Hood counties. Johnson County, Parker County, and Tarrant County until 615. Severe thunderstorms located along a line extending from near Springtown down to Granbury, moving northeast at 55 miles per hour. All North Texas stations affected by this alert are requested to relay the preceding message. New severe thunderstorm warnings are being issued now for portions of Somerville, Johnson, Parker, Tarrant, and Hood counties. Stand by as we alert our other stations in the area on WBAP. We interrupt programming at the request of the National Weather Service to activate the North Texas Emergency Alert System. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for the following counties, Somerville County, Johnson County, Parker County, Tarrant County, and Hood County until 615. Severe thunderstorms are located along a line that extends from Springtown up in northeastern Parker County down to near Granbury, all moving northeast at 55 mile per hour. Uh, 55 mile per hour movement to the northeast and 65 mile per hour wind gusts along with at least penny sized hail, which could become larger. There are spotter reports of 62 mile per hour winds coming in momentarily. There are also reports of multiple mobile homes being overturned in Parker County at this time. Once again, severe thunderstorm warnings now activated for Somerville and Hood counties. Johnson County, Parker County, and Tarrant County until 615. Severe thunderstorms located along a line extending from near Springtown down to Granbury, moving northeast at 55 miles per hour. All North Texas stations affected by this alert are requested to relay the preceding message. Uh, Severe thunderstorm warnings for Wise and Denton, Cook, and Grayson counties. Stand by as we alert our other stations in the area on WBAP. We interrupt programming at the request of the National Weather Service to activate the North Texas Emergency Alert System. The National Weather Service has issued new severe thunderstorm warnings for eastern Wise County, for Denton County, southern Cook County, and southwestern Grayson County until 615. Severe thunderstorms are located along the line from New Fairview down to Decatur, moving northeast at 65 miles per hour. These storms 
contain 65-mile-per-hour wind gusts and maybe some one-inch hail. There are also reports that these storms have already produced some serious damage to mobile homes along the Parker-Wise County border, although the tornado warnings for Parker and Wise County have been canceled. Once again, severe thunderstorm warnings issued now for Eastern Wise, for all of Denton County, Southern Cook County, and Southwestern Grayson County until 615. All North Texas stations affected by this alert are requested to relay the preceding message. Positive, encouraging, Caleb. The following is a test of the emergency alert system. This has been a test of the emergency alert system designed to keep you informed in the event of a national, state, or local emergency. Positive, encouraging, K Love. When you need a 48 state, state ranking. From unexpected stomach upsets.